To make an eco house cozy and cheaper to heat, you need to make sure there are no drafty windows. This week, Darren Hunter visits a Reynolds window factory in Carterton to see if the windows are up to the job. This is uh, seriously high tech. This, uh, this is joinery, but not as we know it. The gone are the days where people uh, set these things out with a pencil and a ruler and a uh, scale rule. It's all generated on a computer now. Uh, when I got to this company uh, 20 years ago, every single thing that uh, anybody did was done by hand. Right? People cut the timber off and then they had to set up the machine and, and process the timber. Yeah. And now uh, pretty much 100% of that is taken over, virtually 100% by the machine. The, uh, the machine, it, it does what it's told. Right. Yeah, because typically yeah. everyone's using aluminium these days and the market for windows and timber is pretty, is pretty small, so it is a big leap. Yeah, we think that the market uh, for wooden joinery is only about somewhere between 3 and 5% of the market. Okay. Pretty small then, isn't it? Yeah, it's huge. The aluminium business is absolutely, or well, virtually 100%. But uh, the interesting thing is that aluminium has pretty much disappeared from Europe because it can't meet the insulation standards. Right. And that's where we think the time is right to get back into wooden joinery in this yeah. country. And I think people in this country are slowly learning that the, the cost of heating a home and keeping it warm, the, the cost is just keeps on going up. And as I keep saying in April, no bills if we put this double glazing and triple glazing in the, and your quality of joinery into the house. Yeah, well the big thing is that people, uh, they kind of understand uh, about cold, but they don't understand or they don't think so much about the, the heat. And, uh, and when you insulate the house, it, it'll keep the house cool in summer as well. Right. In fact, uh, they say, and not necessarily in this country, but the biggest draw on the, uh, the national grid in Australia is the hot months of the year when everybody's got the air conditioning turned up. Right. You know, it's a 24-7 kind of solution yeah. to um, a comfortable living. Yeah. Well, that, that's um, quite poignant for Martinborough because it gets so damn hot in summer. And windy. Yeah, and windy. <laughs> Is there any chance we can have a look through the factory and any chance of making maybe a small mock-up that we can show the client? Yeah, we could do that now. Okay, fantastic. All right. As you know, Cameron, our, our brief is for an eco home. The biggest requirement for that is double glazing to retain the heat, but also windows that actually seal nice and tight and stop the cold air getting in and out. Um, is this product going to suit our needs? Absolutely. Um, the, the, the problem with um, eco housing, really and truly, is the glazing and, and the windows and the doors. I mean, you can put more insulation in the, uh, the walls, under the slab, uh, in the roof, but it's a very major problem to, to achieve the required standard of insulation in the windows. Right. And these windows are designed to do exactly that. Right. But the, the chunkiness, I think anyone could see that the chunky and chunkiness and the quality of this is just unsurpassed, especially when you're considering the weight of the double glazing these Well, the weight, the weight is the main problem, really. Right. Uh, these windows have got to be chunky to carry the weight. Right. And obviously and the double glazing is what's keeping the house warm. Yep. Um, obviously the biggest issue is also when you start opening these things, is these, these hinges going to cope with the weight that this double glazing is going to... Yeah, again, these are the European style hinges that are made to do exactly that. Right. You know, and so everything is, uh, is designed to achieve this one aim right. of making these windows basically the best windows in the world. Right. I absolutely love windows. As much glass as possible. <laughs> but was and it nude or rude? Do it. <laughs> <laughs> and it's important you've got to look